Now, President Cyril Ramaphosa is welcoming 10,000 new police officers today. In his State of the Nation address earlier this year, the president vowed to intensify crime-fighting efforts. He promised to put more boots on the ground. He also said specialized teams would be put in place to focus on specific crimes. There are also crime wardens and peace officers on our streets. Let's find out how effective this is from criminologist Guy Lam. Guy, a very good morning to you. Welcome to the South African Morning. Well, we've got different tiers here uh, of, of officers. We've got uh, the wardens, we've got police officers. Tell us the differences between their functions. Okay, well, what we've seen at the moment, we've got South African police services. They make up the majority of police within South Africa. They are national police force, and they are directed from a national office in Pretoria. And, of course, there are uh, provincial commissioners that make decisions around how resources are used in each particular province. And, you know, the police, we've, you know, been around, you know, for, for many, many years. Certainly, the South African police service was established in the mid-1990s, basically created out of the South African police force from the apartheid era. Um, gone through various changes and reforms over the years. Um, what we're seeing in terms of Kauteng are the crime prevention wardens, which is a relatively new initiative. It's an attempt at the provincial level for the provinces to have more of an involvement in crime fighting, to have more of a direct engagement, because what we see um, previously, certainly in South Africa, is the provinces don't have much involved, direct involvement in crime prevention. They certainly don't have their own police forces. So we've seen, for example, in the Western Cape, establishing their own police force by working with the city of Cape Town. And now what we have in Gauteng is the crime prevention wardens, um, which is you know sort of an arrangement where we've now seen these crime prevention wardens um, supposedly getting the same powers as traffic officials.